Hello, I'm Father James Kubicki with a little reflection on today's saint of the day, Jerome. A lot of religious art and holy cards make the saints look very sweet and otherworldly, people that it's hard to identify with. That's why I like seeing actual photographs of saints. But you won't find any of today's saint, nor will you find any sweet pictures of him. I checked an Italian website of saints that had 97 pictures of Saint Jerome, but not one of them made him look sweet. I suppose this doctor of the church who died in 420 had such a reputation that no one would think of trying to make him look gentle and kind. To put it bluntly, Saint Jerome was a curmudgeon. He had a sharp tongue and could be downright nasty at times. Knowing his weaknesses, he worked against his temptations and tendencies. One pope, looking at a painting of St. Jerome striking his chest with a stone, said, If it were not for that rock, the church would never have declared you a saint. Jerome was a great scholar who translated the Bible from Greek and Hebrew into the language of the people, Latin. But the way he learned those languages wasn't what you'd expect. He was so beset by sexual temptations that he distracted his imagination by studying Hebrew grammar and vocabulary. You have to wonder, would Jerome have become the great scripture scholar he was without those temptations? Here's another example of how God makes everything work together for the good of those whom he loves. Father Kubicki is the National Director of the Apostleship of Prayer. For prayer resources and other information, visit our website at www.apostleshipofprayer.org.